New York's DEC is once again raising tens of thousands of young Atlantic salmon in these pens to release into the Saranac River. State and U.S. Fish and Wildlife Fisheries biologists and volunteers with Trout Unlimited carry dozens of buckets full of salmon to pens at Plattsburgh Boat Basin, where they'll spend the next three weeks before they're released into Lake Champlain. The experimental program is designed to familiarize the salmon with the boat basin near the mouth of the Saranac River in hopes it will increase the likelihood that the salmon will return there in coming years to spawn. 26,000 young salmon will be raised in the pens and then released. The state will also release another 26,000 upstream in the Saranac River. And we just kind of compare to see which, which class of fish will do the best. These are all DNA samples. We can tell which where the parents were, what day they were stocked. And if they come here to spawn, then that restocks the fishery here. It stocks the Saranac River, and so that's what we're trying to do. The Saranac is the most prolific river on Lake Champlain, was of all the rivers on Lake Champlain. Even though it wasn't the longest, but the spawning habitat is spectacular. So that's why we're trying to re replenish that. This is the third year salmon have been raised near the Saranac. Lee says some of the fish released the first year in 2021 may start returning to spawn as soon as this year. Lee says worked last fall to remove parts of two dams on the Saranac River and fish ladders at two more will hopefully help even more Atlantic salmon in the coming years to make it upstream, helping to boost the population in the Saranac.